energy crisis getting severe with times. Nuclear power plants, coal fired power plants, and hydroelectric dams are major sources, but all have issues. Nuclear power plants are expensive with its radiation hazard. Coal fired power plants generate outrageous pollution, while hydroelectric dams have political and ecological controversies. Current renewable sources of energy have low yield yet pricing. Andrew Hazinul ban into the scenario which enjoys several competitive advantages such as low maintenance and high yield of electricity. There is one new idea that we are going to present in the form of Fazinul Bahar that utilizes existing overhead tanks to emulate hydroelectric dams for power generation. This new idea has several advantages that includes eco-friendly power generation, rapid deployment, easy installation, reduced labor and high yield of green energy. Hazinul Bahar is mainly divided into three sections. This is our first block of Hazinul Bahar, which consists of overhead tank, PPT and IPT generators, battery housing and charging units, and inverter. Next block of Hazinul Bahar consists of simplified windmill, rotary screw air compressors, air storage tanks, and another IPT. The last block of Hazinul Bahar consists of in house PPTs placed in underground tanks. This is the block diagram that describes the power generation mechanism through overhead tanks. It is comprising of hydropower and hybrid wind hydropower to emulate the hydroelectric dams. The compressed air storage driven by windmill drives another IPT. Power generated by these IPTs and PPTs of in-house tanks are brought to the battery housing and charging unit. This DC power is converted into AC power by means of a locally designed inverter. I am Nasir Mahmood. I played my part as principal design advisor of the Khazin ul Bahar. I served as a mechanical design advisor in the machine in Khazin ul Bahar. Hazin ul Bahar has numerous financial advantages such as affordability, fast return on investment, low risk investment, carbon trading, and scalability. Affordability. Hazin ul Bahar has very low initial cost that makes it viable solution for developing and underdeveloped countries. Of estimation is fifteen hundred US dollar in total. Fast ROI. Financially, Khazinul Bahar is sustainable, permissible, and profitable business that promises fast return of investment. A conservative estimate is one year to back even. Low risk investment. Khazinul Bahar integrates tested and proven technology. Its raw material, wind and water, are less susceptible to market inflation. Carbon trading. High yield of electricity from Khazinul Bahar can potentially be used to reduce carbon emission, as reported in Kyoto Protocol.